Hey guys, it's your boy Joe back at it again, codingphase.com. Today we have a new video about a web developer who's homeless in San Francisco right now. Now, I don't want to laugh about this. It's not a laughing matter, but this has to be one of the most ridiculous things <laughs> that I've seen. So this guy, he was, I think he's like from, uh, was it San Antonio, Texas, right? And he decided to become a web developer he's like okay cool I'm a web developer I'm going to go to San Francisco and I'm gonna leave everything behind and I'm just gonna find a job over there so he was living in his car and then his car got repossessed they took the car and got towed so now the guy's sleeping on a bench somewhere and he basically now is with a sign outside in a corner saying take my resume like hey hire me and supposedly this thing has gone viral and a lot of people have been talking about it i mean i don't know i just found out about this today and i wanted to make a reaction because <laughs> to me this is so ridiculous this goes to show you like the length that people go to to go work in san francisco like you have a job where you live, you have companies where you live and you was living good, but you decided to leave everything behind to go work in San Francisco. Like people are, I don't know. Sometimes I'll be like, damn, I don't understand people. Like I understand people want to work at Facebook, Google, uh, whatever, Twitter, whatever company's popping at the moment. Right. I understand you want to work at those companies, man. But there is no excuse for you to be homeless. Like, it doesn't make sense to me. Like, if you want to go move over there, start applying to jobs there before you get there. All right. Start applying to jobs. And also too, take into account that you have to have money on you. You got to save money. You can't just go to another state and just be like, hey, I'm just going to find a job. Like, it's not that easy. All right. There's a lot of competition in San Francisco because everybody wants to work there. But that goes back to my original point that I've done in multiple videos. It's like, bro, you don't need to work in a company in San Francisco. If you want to become a web developer, you don't need to go and move over there. There's millions of jobs out here in your area, your town, your city, wherever the hell you live. There's a job for web developers like do the right thing, man do it properly don't just go in and try to move out there without knowing anybody without no plan without no money like this is one of those things where you hear like oh man this guy was such a hard worker like he he went out there and, and he was handing out resumes like bro you look ridiculous to me this is like one of the dumbest things that i've seen online and has been connected to web developer because you know i get um notifications from google for the keyword web developer i like to know what news is out there but this is one of the most stupidest things that i've seen in a long time like how are you gonna go to san francisco without no jobs without no money in your pocket without knowing anybody there and just like living off your car and then you just gonna go there you lose your car and now you're homeless sleeping on a freaking bench like you know how crazy this is like i understand people want to work at google and facebook and whatever but do it the right way guys like you don't want to be like this guy and you know and some people might say man he's a hard worker he's this this and that no this is like a crazy person like you have to have your life in order. You have to have priorities. <laughs> like you can't just be like, hey, I, I, I like San Francisco. I'm not just going to leave everything behind and, and just going to show up over there and be like, hey, I'll find a job. Like, nah, man, like start applying, you know, get some job interviews through online, some Skype calls, like do it properly, guys. You know, this thing is not worth uh, you know, your safety, your, your health. Cause now you, you sleeping on the street. Like you, you, you know what I mean? Like you're homeless. You probably don't have no money to eat. You'll be here giving out your resumes. Like, bro, this is not the right way to do things, man. And it just pisses me off because this thing is attached to this keyword, this keyword that I'm so proud of. I love the idea 
about people learning to code and becoming web developers. And I love the fact that web development changed my life. But having this, this is like a crazy person who's like, hey, man, I just moved everything over there. I'm handing out resumes on the street and I'm homeless. Like, bro, do the shit right. Like, come on, man. Like, you're giving a bad name to web developers. You know, and whoever's going to leave a bad comment on this, like, oh, man, uh, Joe, he's just trying to, you know, live out his dreams. Like, no, he could live out his dreams anywhere. You don't have to go to San Francisco. You don't need to be in, in Mountain View. Like, there's a million jobs in your area already. Like, stop begging for shit and just do shit the right way. You know what I mean? But anyways, guys, um, it's your boy Joe back at it again. CodingFace.com. I just saw this and I needed to make a video about it. Because this is kind of ridiculous. Like, people want jobs at Facebook and Google and all the other bullshit companies there. Like, so bad that they will go to the length of being homeless. Embarrassing themselves for a freaking job over there. Like, you can find a job anywhere, guys. So, anyways, man. It's your boy Joe. Back at it again. Codingphase.com. Go to codingphase.com to learn how to code and learn how to actually get jobs online. Unlike this guy, which I wish somebody would have told him, hey, man, go to codingphase.com. He will show you how to find a job through online. You don't, you don't have to go to the length of being homeless in the street to find a job. Like You, you look crazy out here, kid. Okay? Anyways, I'm out of here.